What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Matty J, aka Scrub Killer. <sighs> well, it is Christmas Eve. It is 7.25 p.m. over here on the West Coast, good old Southern California. And I just wanted to wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays, you guys. Some people don't celebrate Christmas, whatever it is that you guys celebrate. Happy Hanukkah, whatever it is. Blessings to you, best days to you. I hope your 2011 was very eventful. And I hope everything worked out for you guys. Uh, my 2011, it was back and forth. I'm not going to lie. It was a little hectic at times. And sometimes it was really great. The end, the end of the year was perfect for me. Um, I finally got my stuff going with the Sheriff's Academy and things like that. So um, it was definitely a relief to finally get that started and get things moving in that direction. Um, if you guys didn't uh, know from my last video, um, I'll be submitting my background in March, the end of March. So I can um, get into the Academy hopefully by the beginning of May, you guys. That's what I'm shooting for as I get panic knifed. <laughs> oh, well, that's cool, man. It's Modern Warfare 3. I'm not even tripping. But, um... But yeah, how was your guys' 2011? Let me know in the uh, in the comments section. Uh, what were what were the highlights of your guys' year and whatnot? You know, how, how did everything go for you guys? You know, because I told you I like to interact with you guys. I like to know what's going on in your lives. Some people some people say they just sit at home and play video games all day. Some people are like, oh, I have to work three jobs and i gotta do this and that and it's crazy man like some of the stories that you hear like some of the things that people have to go through is really unbelievable now fortunately i have been blessed um in my life to where i, I haven't had to necessarily struggle i guess you could say with uh with a lot of things that are going on in my world um my life has been uh, my life hasn't been too bad you guys it hasn't been too shabby um, some some people think you can get into some of these lobbies. Some people think that Modern Warfare Three is is your life, and that's all you do is play Modern Warfare Three because I'm prestiged, I guess. So I guess that's all that I do. <laughs> Look, guys, I really do not play this game that much, unfortunately. Um, I would like to play more so I can get more gameplays and stuff for you guys, like beast gameplays. But I really just don't have the time. I mean, you guys, if you guys don't know, if you guys are new to the channel, and whatnot. Um, I work full time. I work 40 hours a week as a security officer for Kaiser Hospital. And then I, after that, I get off of work and I go straight to the gym because I am a part time personal trainer. I like to train people. I like to help people achieve their fitness goals and stuff, especially for the new years coming up and stuff like that. And everybody wants to be uh, be fit for summertime and stuff like that. So I'm trying to get people, you know, to where they want to be at, you know, goal wise when it comes to uh, uh, weight and uh, health and stuff like that. So I do that for about four hours each day, you guys. And, you know, that's Monday through Friday going four hours strong at the gym with people and trying to help them out you know better themselves and it's it, it does get hectic you guys it's not the easiest thing to do but like i said my life is still is still wonderful you know uh real quick about the gameplay you guys uh i am running the, the specialist as you can see i'm running with the i, I call these the <laughs> I call these the uh, the uh, two beast machine pistols because they are just they're too strong in this game. Now the reason why I use them is because there are so many people that rush around in groups, and you just can't kill them all. And for some reason, every time I use any other secondary machine pistol, it doesn't kill. So I said, you know what? Forget it. I know people are gonna talk crap and stuff like that about the you know about the machine pistols, but hey. If everybody else is going to use them in the game, I might as well use them in the game because I don't want to be left at a disadvantage, you know, going into games and stuff like that. As you can see, these guys that we're playing against, um, they were trying to lag, man, the whole game. It was weird. As you can see right there, I was stuck on that staircase. Um, I'll, you know, hopefully they weren't, you know, trying to lag switch the game. Some people do that, you guys. Some people try to lag switch the game, and it's unbelievable that people, like, the lengths that people go to, to, uh try to you know cheat people out of kills and stuff like that if you guys didn't see my last video the boosters and cheaters i mean that's the kind of stuff that i'm talking about you guys stuff like that where just people try to alter the game in cheap ways to try to help them out and the funny part is is it's never anybody that's really like good at the game that's the messed up part that's the part that irritates me i guess the most is because i know it's people that aren't really that good and it's just people that want to be 
that want to be pains in the ass, I guess you could say, oh, get sprayed down. That's why I use machine pistols, you guys. That is exactly the reason why I use the dual FMG9s is because you will run into multiple people like that. The spawns are crazy. It's just unbelievable. They have Charlie and Alpha right now. We have Bravo. And they're going to spawn directly in the room that I was heading to. Like, come on, really? That doesn't make no sense. <laughs> I'm just I'm just mowing people down right now you guys I really don't I really try not to use the machine pistols that much but hey the things are beastie I use them coming around every corner because I mean you you spray those things and it's pretty much guaranteed to kill almost every single time it's crazy but anyways enough about the gameplay you guys uh, what's going on for you guys with two, uh, 2012 you guys what are you guys doing for the new years and whatnot I definitely like to know um, pff, my New Year's, you guys, I'm not going to lie, I ain't going to be doing nothing. I'll probably be kicking it with my kid. Now, you guys know that I have a daughter and uh, she, I mean, sh she's my world, man. She, she's she's the reason why I do uh, so many uh, other things that I'm doing right now in life. Um, YouTube, yes, it's for fun. But at, at the same time, <laughs> that guy with the, oh, my God, dead man's hand. Who we thank God for specialist. But, um, <laughs> You know, it's just like the reason why I do things, uh, the certain things in life is because of her. Uh, if it wasn't for her, honestly, you guys, I'd probably be doing a lot of bad things. I'm, I'm not saying that I'm some criminal and I go around robbing people and, you know, anything like that. You guys, trust me, I'm not that kind of a person. You know, I'm not that bad, I guess you can say. But, you know, I have my moments. And look at this lag. Come on, man. Just die already. But I do have my moments. I think everybody has their moments uh, in life. I think that's what makes us human. You know, it, it, it kind of keeps everybody normal and on an even kill. But, um, <clears throat> excuse me while I clear my throat. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, my daughter, man, she, she, she really does mean the world to me, you guys. I mean, without her, I honestly could say that I'd be doing a lot of bad things. Um, and like I said before, like not like not going around committing crimes or nothing like that. Just being, just being reckless. I guess you could say I would be a, a very reckless individual. Only because I know that if I didn't have a kid, then I wouldn't really have anything to worry about. Like I wouldn't be drastically affecting somebody else's life. But with her, she keeps me balanced because I know if anything happens to me, and you know anything like that anything happens to anybody in our family that it's going to affect her in a bad way and i do not want that i mean if you guys have kids or know people that have kids i mean you you can ask those those people as well they would do anything for their child and and that's the way that i look at life you know and, and that's the reason why i do the things that i do and stay out of trouble and and all that good stuff i mean my day is pretty much set i mean i'm 24 years old you guys um, if you guys didn't know, I'm 24 years old. 24 years old, you still hear people partying and stuff like that. Not me. I mean, I go to work, I go to the gym, I come home and I play a little Modern Warfare 3, you know, and go to sleep and do it again the next day. That's pretty much it, you guys. I don't go around acting crazy, drinking, partying, none of that stuff. I got it all out the way when I was uh, when I was in college my first year. So no more partying for your boy. But anyways, let me know what you guys are uh, looking forward to for 2012. Maybe some New Year's resolutions. Uh, you can go ahead and put those in the comment section if you'd like. You don't have to. It's totally your choice. Get sprayed down. Drop shot. <laughs> I'm trying to get used to that uh, to the controller. It's got me killed a couple times. Um, uh, I'm playing on uh, on tactical now. I was playing on default before, but I'm trying to get used to it, you guys. But this gameplay is wrapping up right here as I pick up this final kill. Final score for the match was 36 kills, 4 deaths. I had 4 assists. Nothing very special about the gameplay, you guys. I just really want to do this commentary to wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays. Happy Hanukkah, whatever it is that you guys celebrate. So, big ups to y'all. See y'all in 2012, man. It's your boy. I'm out. Peace.